This video will explain the high and low pressure relationship in the automotive AC system. In an automotive AC system, the compressor is driven by a pulley on the engine's crankshaft. The AC system is designed to create pressure changes between the evaporator, which is where heat is absorbed, and the condenser where heat is released to cool the interior of the vehicle. When refrigerant travels to the evaporator, it absorbs hot air from the cabin's interior. At the condenser, the refrigerant, which is now a vapor, is compressed and forced through the condenser, turning into a liquid and releasing the heat previously absorbed from the evaporator. The high side refers to the side of the system in red. The high side starts at the discharge side of the compressor and travels through the condenser where heat transfers to condensation and then to the receiver dryer and finishes at the expansion valve. The compressor creates high pressure by compressing the low pressure vapor from the evaporator so that the high pressure vapor can release heat at the condenser. This pressure change happens again at the expansion valve where the refrigerant is slowed down and changes pressure. The low side refers to the side of the system in blue. Starting at the expansion valve which creates low pressure, refrigerant travels to the evaporator where it transfers the heat from inside the vehicle and travels to the compressor where it is turned into high pressure and the whole process repeats again. For more tech tips visit gpdtechtips.com.